Alan Edgehead here, and welcome back to Let's Play East, Book 1 and 2 on the last episode. We started exploring the Abandoned Mine. And in the Abandoned Mine, we have super duper limited visibility. We explored the first floor of the mine. Now we are in the second depths of the mine. We found three items earlier. Now it's time to find three more. So let's get back to the game. Hopefully I won't get too lost right off the bat. Ouch. There's one really important item that I want to find. Preferably next because it will help me immensely. And here's the treasure. Yes, that that is the item that I wanted to find. The heel ring. It allows us to heal while we are stationary as we wear it. So I'm going to go ahead and put the armor ring back on. We have found the heel ring. Let me consult my checklist. There are two more things to find in the second depths of the mine. So when in doubt, wall hug. That monster looked very, very evil. Okay, dead end. Kill. Is there a hole here? Nope. Explorations. Okay. Take that guy out. What's down here? Was I just in this spot? I don't know. It's hard to tell sometimes. Big tangerine guy. Treasure. Hey, I'll use the treasure box key. We found the Rota Tree Seed. Now the last thing to find is the main thing that we came to the mines for. That would be the Silver Harmonica. And that way leads me to the exit of this area into the next depths of the mine. And I'm not ready to do that just yet. I want to find the Silver Harmonica. So let's make our way back through the mines and see if I can't stumble upon that silver harmonica somewhere. I'm going to take out any enemy that I may come across. That, I don't know where that leads me. Is that back to where I came from? I'm not exactly sure where this actually leads me. Uh. Whoa. Whoa. We're not ready to be here yet. That is the third depths of the mine. So I'm going to go ahead and equip the heel ring. Take that thing out. Maybe I did need to go across that bridge in the mine shaft. I'm not sure, but I want to lock that heel ring in with a save. So let's try to make our way back to that mine shaft, because maybe I did need to be in that particular area. Now I'm just wandering aimlessly. Pretty sure that's where I came from. That's the start. Kill that. What's this way? Never hurts to be thorough. Okay, there's where we found the heel ring. Let's make our way down from here. Freaking tangerine, man. Okay, mine shaft. I think it just leads me in a circle. Like back to the other side. Yeah, go figure. Level. Cool beans. Freaking tangerine man. Ow. Okay, while I'm in this little predicament. 
of being low on health, I'm going to heal. Predicament no longer. Equipment armor ring. So let's find that silver harmonica. It's got to be in here somewhere. Jeez. I don't really want to pause to find it. I don't want to be pausing too much. But I will if I have to. I'm not exactly sure where I'm going at this point. This is where I just was. with the phoenix enemies that's not what i want to do just yet where is that treasure chest what's this way okay this is the actual entrance to the second depths of the mine the mine the mine oh my goodness the mine is one big pain if we could just get past this, it would be so much easier. Oh my gosh, the mine. Where is what I'm looking for? Ow. I swear I've been in that indention like five times already. Let's go this way. Tangerine Man. Treasure! Eight all gets the silver harmonica. Now we can make our way into. Actually, now that we have the silver armor, we may want to go all the way back and take it back to Rhea. So I will see you back in Manea Town as we give this back to Rhea. Okay, we're back in Manea Town after finding the silver harmonica in the mine. What? You found my silver harmonica? How can I ever thank you? I can offer, cannot offer you much except let me play a special tune for you. Please remember these sweet notes when you think of me. Here's the book that Sarah left with me. We get the volume Toba, which this is a different translation. Anytime you see Toba, I'm going to be referring to it as Tova, T-O-V-A-H, the more correct translation of the word. Volume Tova and Priest Tova. So, Adol gets the volume Tova. Thank you very much. If there is anything I can do for you, please let me know. So, we've returned Rhea's silver harmonica. While we're here, let me check what I actually have. I already have the best sword that I can buy. And I have all the equipment that I can buy. Let's stop off at Pim's shop. What is the speed on? Okay, good. It's on fast. Let's stop off at Pim's shop. We want to buy a wing. Luckily, we have a real whole lot of gold, so it's not that big a deal. And money is practically useless at this point, so I'm going to go be a completionist and buy the first sword, the second and third shield. And the second armor, if I have enough. I'm pretty sure I'll have enough. Now let's check our inventory. 
I have everything except the silver sword, which I can't get just yet. So, I will see you back right at the entrance to the third depths of the mine. Actually, before I even get back to the mine, now that we found that Rota tree seed, if we come up to the Rota tree out here, we can actually understand the language of the Rota tree. My name is Rota. Let me tell you a secret of Asteria. There is a silver sword buried at the foot of my brother. So we need to find the second Rota tree, which is at the southern portion of the map. I passed the Rota tree on the way back to the mine and remembered that I found the Rota tree seed, but here's his brother. Destruction will once again plague the land of East. Violence will reign chaos. I can feel it in my roots. It is time for you to set out on your journey, young man. Godspeed. A shining light flows out from the roots of the tree. Adol gets the silver sword. So now we actually have all the silver equipment. And we're actually really close to a level, so I'm going to get that on on screen before I off screen the trek to the third depths of the mine. Level. See you at the entrance to the third depths of the mine. Okay, I think we're finally to the entrance to the third depths of the mine. Let's head in. And as soon as we get in here, I'll make a save to make sure. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yes, we're in the third depths of the mine because I remember the Phoenix monsters all too well. So I'm going to equip the armor ring and save my game. Okay, there are three items to find in the mine depths three. Hopefully I won't take forever to find them. Whoa, new monster. Uh, okay. Treasure! Now, how do we get to that? That is the question. Freaking Phoenix! Man! That is ridiculous. Uh, treasure. Dom key, the Dom key. We found it. So there are two more items to find. Only one is in a treasure chest out here. So let me equip the heal ring and heal up. We need to find one more treasure chest. And I don't even technically need to find this treasure chest that I'm looking for. But I'm a completionist, and I want to find it. It's a heal potion. And I already have a heal potion, so it's just going to heal me. Automatically. I technically don't even need to pick it up to move on with the story. But I'm going to. Maybe. I'm back at the entrance. This is already getting really, really crazy. Let's see if I can't make my way to said heal potion. Uh, where am I at? Uh, don't even know anymore. The mine is the most confusing area in East Book 1. I think there's a door... to the next area at the right somewhere. Come on, Phoenix Monster. 
freaking A. Uh. Uh, we've been up here before, okay. Luckily, I'm fighting a lot of enemies and getting a lot of experience. Uh. I'll eventually find my way. Two phoenixes. Uh, is there a way to go down anywhere? I forget the trick to this area. Uh, we're back at the beginning again. This is not good at all. Uh, the mine makes me look a fool. Every time, all the time. Uh, am I back at the entrance again? No, this is where that other treasure chest was. Ys, why do you do this to me? What did I ever do to you but love you, Ys? Freaking thing. I know that there's a trick door somewhere. And it's going to drive me crazy looking for it. Uh, uh, uno momento, I'm going to find the exit to this area, and I will see you after I find it. I seem to have found my way after stumbling around from a bit, for a bit, uh, from where I found the Dom key, we come this way, go back down the little narrow hallway, make our way this way, and go down this way, and here's the heal potion. I already had a heal potion, so that will restore my health, and now it's time to make our way to the most obnoxious boss in East 1. We're not too far off from it. It's just down this way. And here it is, the boss door. So let's heal up real quick. Put the armor ring back on. Make a quick save. And we go in and take on the boss. We try to take his treasure, but to no avail. The boss here splits up into a million bats, and you can only hurt him while he's got his arms open. So you need to lure the bats into a corner or something, wait for him to open his arms, and attack him. And that is not how you do it. I'm attacking too early. He's, there's only a split chance for you to actually harm him without harming yourself. And that's when his arms are open. Luckily, I did a crap ton of damage to him, so I'm confident that I can, I can take him this time. If I can just lure him into a corner. And I only hurt myself that time. This is going to be brutal. This is the the most annoying boss in the game. Golly. I can't seem to get a clean hit at all. Nope. Not going to happen this time. I'm confident I can get him eventually. Uh, darn it! 
we did it. Game over. Come on. Tell me it's game over. I was wondering if it was ever going to work here. Okay. Take three. Freaking obnoxious bat monster. Lure him into a corner. You jerk. You... What? 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 Okay. Take four. Obnoxious bat monster. Freaking A. You annoy the crap out of me, man. Just form a bat already. Oh, you jerk. Okay, I gotta go. Oh, man. Oh, man. I'm not getting clean hits. That's the problem here. Darn it. I'm always too early. Oh, I got him. Oh, what a that was a great hit. Take that obnoxious bat monster. That might have been three levels right there. I have no idea. But we get the volume dabby. Which in the better translation, it's still dabby. It's just spelled D A B B Y. Volume Daddy, what's this way? So, I'm not going to do the whole trip out of the mines. Uh, normally, I'm going to inventory and, uh, wing my way back to Zeptic Village. Maybe. So, next time on Let's Play East, Book 1 and 2, we're going to get our new two books translated by Jeva. I'm Alan Edgehead, and I'll see you then.